If you love me, let me hear you say my name, my name. If you love me, let me hear you, babe. Cause I wonder if you feel the same, same. Or just tell me if you feel the same. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today I'm going to be sharing with you my daily cleaning routine, taking you throughout the house, showing you some tasks I do on the daily to make sure that the weekly doesn't get so overwhelming. I used to be the kind of person that would clean one time a week, like six hours, and it became honestly very stressful and overwhelming for me. So now that I have two kids, I don't have time for that. So I have to implement things that I do daily that are gonna make the weekly so much easier. I was kind of one that made my own little checklist, would follow it, and I thought it'd be really really helpful for you guys for me to create a digital version I make it so much easier when doing your cleaning tasks at home so I've created this bundle I'm going to be doing a weekly as well as a daily checklist everything that I do in my own home for you guys to follow also as a big thank you for your constant love and support I will have down in the description bar a link for you guys to check out a free printable to-do list so I thought this would be helpful for you guys to use on a daily basis to stay on task tackle all your goals and all of that good stuff so if you enjoy cleaning cleaning videos be sure to give this one a big thumbs up hit that little subscribe button so you don't miss out on my future home and lifestyle videos and let's get cleaning all right so the very first thing that i like to do every day is unload my dishwasher this is going to allow me to have room for any dishes that accumulate throughout the day i have a clear space and i can start adding them as i go and just so you guys know this whole cleaning routine i do it daily but it's throughout my day it's not one lump of slump sump of time that I have to kind of cut out of my schedule. I just do it little by little throughout the day. This way I can go to my checklist, check off the items. That's why I love having it because it makes sure that I don't forget anything. So as you can see, I finished task number one, which was unloading and putting away the dishes. So I go right onto my checklist, I check it off. As you can see here, I actually like to keep it inside one of these little clear bags that you can get right at um, the dollar store. So extremely affordable if you wanna be fancy, you can even laminate, take your dry erase marker, check off your things. And then when you're done the day, you literally just take a napkin, wipe it clean or a rag, and you're ready to start fresh. You don't have to worry about printing multiple times. This allows you to keep it handy. I keep it right in my kitchen drawer and every time I need to pull it out for the weekly as well as the daily I have easy access and I can follow each time Then once all the surfaces are clean, the dishes are done, it's time to toss away the trash. And I actually go right outside as soon as it's ready, throw it out. I honestly was guilty of leaving it like on the side of the floor and wait for Mike to kind of throw it out. But unfortunately, it did like a little damage on one of our parts of our wood floors. So now I just do it immediately after taking it out, make sure I get rid of it. This way the rest of the day I can have a fresh bag to use. And then Mila, of course, she's constantly playing all day. So little by little, I kind of just pick up the living room area I do it once during the day around noontime after she's played in the morning and then I'll do it again before bed so really simple and easy just kind of getting on top of that and then you know it's gonna get messy quickly so I don't try to go too crazy for the daily same thing with my pillows quickly fix up the pillows a little bit but that's about it
adding the cleaning of the sinks and bathroom surfaces has made a world of a difference when it comes to my daily routine and I do this every single day it makes it a lot easier come the weekly then once again pull out my checklist and I check off the things that I accomplish in the bathroom I will say when I'm on the first floor I travel with my checklist to each room that I do checking it off as I go but when I go upstairs I'll leave it down on the kitchen counter and then once I'm done doing the couple of tasks up there like making our beds putting clothes away anything like that then as soon as I come back down I'll go ahead and run through all of the things that I did while I was upstairs So this one here was actually a recent addition. I did not need to use this previously, but doing a load a day. <laughs> when it was just me, Mike, and Mila, I feel like there wasn't too much accumulation of clothing, but now with a five month old as well, two kids, it just gets a little crazy with the clothing department. So I like to do a load every single day. Believe it or not, it adds up pretty quickly. So you're not gonna have like a huge, huge piles. I used to do like two to three in a day and it was so stressful. Now my goal is to wash, dry, and fold all in the same day while those clothes are washing I'm doing other tasks playing with the kids things like that you guys can see I also will go ahead and tidy up the dining room also you guys this video was filmed like three to four weeks ago I wanted my fall videos to go up first hence why I have all this stuff like a mess it is now already decorated and it's set up nicely because I started homeschooling Mila I'm sorry you guys you can see the lighting is changing it's getting darker since like I said later at night I like to do the last of the folding once all the clothes are dried and then I'll go ahead and put them away so get that load folded up you can see it's a variety of things it's like towels some of my clothes some of Mila's things just because I do one load a day in order to create a one full load you do have to of course mix things the only one that I keep separately that I'll do just once a week are actually Capri's clothes because I'm still washing just her things on her own then after I folded everything on my sofa I'll go ahead put it back into this basket and then it makes it really simple to carry on upstairs and then go ahead and put everything away so this now completes sharing with you guys my daily cleaning routine I hope you all enjoyed after the clothes are finally put away inside of our drawers I'll go ahead and take my cleaning checklist wipe everything clean you guys can see how easy it was to just wipe everything off and then it's ready to use for the next time I hope you guys love these as much as I do I will have the link down in the description bar it would mean so much to me if you supported and purchasing these and I will talk to you in my next one bye